Hi everyone, this is Fatma from Addictive Tips and I'm going to show you how you can use PowerShell to download files on Windows 10. The command for downloading files from PowerShell is on your screen right now. Before you can use it, you're going to have to edit it a bit. You have to replace URL with the URL or the link to the file. And you need to replace file.extension with the name of the file that you're downloading and its extension. You have to do this in both instances. The first instance is the file name that's on the server that you're downloading it from. And the second instance is the name that you want to save the file with. So for example, if I'm downloading this file and it has this name that you see on your screen, I'm going to change it to image. The extension will of course depend on the file that you're downloading. Once you've edited the command for the file that you want to download, paste it into PowerShell and tap enter. The file is going to be downloaded to the same location that you were in when you executed the command. So I executed this in my user folder and that's where I'm going to find the file. If you want to save the file to a different folder, what you need to do is use the cd command to move to that folder. Like this, I've moved to the downloads folder. And now when I execute the same command, it's going to save the file to the downloads folder. You can also specify the download location in the command if you want, and the command for that is on your screen right now. There's basically two ways of doing it, and you can pick whichever one suits you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later with more tech tips.